Hi, in this video we will show you how easy to replace the faceplate on your module on example of other generator. You can also apply the same technique on every other endorphins module. Here we have further generator with the classic gold panel which we will convert by placing the black panel. The first step is to take off all the knobs from the pots. You can use the different tools like pliers or tweezers. I'm putting the tweezers between the plastic knob and the nut and press lightly to avoid the scratches. Sometimes the knobs are not easy to remove, so be patient and do it gently. To unscrew two frequency knobs, use flat screwdriver from the side. When all the knobs are off, we continue by unscrewing the different types of nuts from the panel. The biggest ones are M9 hexagon nuts on the frequency pots. We use different size nut heads, but you can also use pliers very gently. The nuts on other pots are M7 and M6 on the switches. For the knurled nuts on the jacks you can use special screwdriver from Mauser, but also we use special head for the electric screwdriver. Put all the knobs and nuts aside to not lose them. Push all the shafts into a panel to remove it from PCB. You can leave the initial red button or replace its cap by a different color. Gently lift the cap from the bottom with the slimmest flat screwdriver. Flip the module by facing the button on the floor and remove the button's cap. Once it's off, be careful, do not lose a small spring inside the button. Take the button you want to replace and remove the cap from its base. The same as we did before. Be careful again, do not lose a spring. Take the cap and install it on the button's base according to its flat cut on the side. The hardest part is behind. Take the panel and put it on the PCB. Slightly wiggle it and touch every element to make it fit fully. Some jacks and LEDs may resist of entering their holes. Take a screwdriver and check all the jacks by moving them gently. Move the mood wave knob from the side. Pay attention to the LEDs and do not let them bend under the panel. When panel is on, screw back all nuts we have in the reverse order.
You can leave previous or replace the new knobs. You can get additional deshaft knobs from our accessory store. Put on the frequency knobs and fix them with the screw on the side. The conversion is ready. Install it in your rack.